Hi everybody, in this video I'm going to show you how to make fast, cheap and easy organic texture for your mini wargaming bases. As you can see I'm making this video on a holiday. I was going to do a, a frequently asked questions video but since you guys never ask me questions I thought I would do a little small tutorial video. And uh, welcome to the workshop. So the bases that you see here were all done with the same texturing tool. To make this tool, I melted a piece of plastic with a hot air gun. I used this for the gibbering mouther and the Idenet dipkin. So if you haven't checked it out, please go and watch those videos. Very short tools and materials list. So if we take a closer look, we can see a whole variety of textures that we can use. I'm gonna start off by mixing up the epoxy putty. You can use green stuff or whatever you like. Mix it up thoroughly. And then I let it dry for about 20 to 30 minutes so it hardens a little bit, which makes it easier to get the texture in. Divide the sausage into the number of bases and then I apply these. Take your sculpting tool and spread it over the base. Then before applying the texture, wet the epoxy sculpt and press in the texture. Clean up the sides of the base. And this is the result. Six different organic textures that you can, for example, use for some Nurgle bases. I'm going to show you some paint jobs that I did. Now, as I was on a holiday, I used quite a limited palette. I start this with a dark red and then a bunch of uh, dry brushes with carmine red up to a white or up to an ivory white. Then I washed in the shadows with a pin wash with some blue. And then when dry, I covered the entire model with a layer of clear red by Tamiya. Then a bit of dry brush with pink and ivory on the sides and this is the result. Time to show you another one. This was done with an ivory base coat, then a flesh wash, and again with blue in the deepest shadows to give it some color variation. And this was then allowed to dry, given a dry brush with ivory and a a coat of gloss varnish and this is the result as you can see very easy very cool effect i want to thank you all very much for watching see you next time for a new update please like please subscribe bye